Here we are, day eight of the Mind Over Mushroom Challenge. But I've put in a solid week already. And I mean, last night, I'm not gonna lie, I, it was a little bit more like I was just resigned to my fate. Um, but you know, got through that meal. And um, I'm not going to hypothesize about tonight's meal. I'm a little excited just in the sense that I'm a big finger food lover and I love french fries. So I found a recipe on the internet and it is mushroom fries. Now I'm excited because it's pretending to be something I love but I'm also really not excited because it's something I absolutely despise, masked as something that I love. So now that I'm thinking about it, maybe this is a bad idea. These are what I made today. I know this is a mushroom and so my mind is like hey what are you doing don't eat that and I'm doing it anyways they're actually not disgusting portobellos are maybe not the enemy yum I actually said yum I said yum about a mushroom that's crazy As a mushroom hater, I'm not disappointed. I, I realize that's a little contradictory and people are probably confused and they don't know if it's a good thing or a bad thing. But if you like mushrooms, go for it. If you don't like mushrooms, this could be a recipe to, you know, try it out, see how you do, see if you can change your life a little bit, see if you can stop being such a fussy eater. Just a thought, do it if you want. So that's an end to day number eight of the Mind Over Mushroom Challenge. And tonight's meal, of course, the portobello mushroom fries. They're alright. They are alright. I will I will give them that. They did not they did not do bad things to me. I got confused along the way because I never I don't eat mushrooms, so I just Wow, am I eating chicken? And then I had to think about it, like, oh my god, it's a mushroom. Wow, it's just stunningly easy.